Hi, I'm Anthony Hudson. Fair crowd in to watch this game today. It's a pleasure to welcome Gary Lyon. Hi, Hutto. Can't wait for this one to start. Tonight, it's the Saints at home against Hawthorne. They run on in full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. Yes, I do. It's a battle in the court on the four goal. Their forwards bring the pressure inside 50. It's going to give them a massive chance of walking out on top. They run on in full confidence, they're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. Captains converge for the toss of the coin. St Kilda winning the toss. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. What an exciting matchup we have here today. And here's the bounce to begin the game. McAvoy slaps it away. He has the ball. Just gave it away. Clean pick up by Savage. Keeps him moving. Finds his man. Goes by foot. He takes the mark. Loney gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Move it on. He likes his chances from here. That one hits the woodwork. Now they lead by one. Players move as they look to provide an option. Stratton tucks it into the pocket. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Unfortunately, not for long as the ball goes out. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Opportunity for Mitchell. Advances through the tackle. Got boot to ball. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Drop punt. Finds its way home from Webster. That will settle his nerves. Gets his first on the ball. They get around him after that effort. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Back with another centre bounce. Won the hit out. Doing well was Abbott. Decides to kick. Takes a simple grab. Chose to kick it. Hill got under it. Go for goal number one. Does well to cut off the kick. Moved on by Crawley. Good body work to win the mark. Slams it on the boot. Takes the mark. Burgoyne goes with the kick. McAvoy gets on the end of this. Hacks it forward. A chance to gather the ball. He takes the shot. No luck from there. It's a behind. Hawthorne bring it under a two-goal margin. Carlisle considering the options on the kick here. Spears the ball. Simply outplayed his opponent. Kick by Howard. Spins past the tackler. Just got the hands in the back there. Drives towards half forward. 
Shields leading the race to the loose ball. Well taken at ground level. Geary creates a contest. Beautiful tackle, Hutto. Membry takes it well. Looks up with a kick. Steele looks to get onto the football. Wingard kicks in heavy traffic. McAvoy did well to win that ball. He's a long way from home, but he might have the wheels. Move it on. Go for goal number one. No issues with that drop punt. McAvoy getting the crowd involved. All locked up on the scoreboard. That's a really good team goal. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. About to resume hostilities. Punched away. With the ball now. Gunston Campbell's out in front. How it runs. Go for goal number one. That's a big goal. What an effort. His teammates rush over. St Kilda by six points. About to resume play. Taps it down. Smith dug out the loose ball. Can't take the mark. Robertson collects the loose ball. Puts the handball out in front. Has it now. Quickly onto the boot. The ball ends up with... With a driving kick. Billings was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Heads long with that kick. Strong mark in the contest. Okay. He heads for home. Abbott misses at home. Pretty happy with that one. St Kilda by two goals. He did really well there and gets the reward. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. Back in the middle now. Slapped away. He has the ball. He gains possession. His first touch of the footy. Segler put himself a free. Ball collected. Kicks hurriedly. Takes that one strongly. 50 metres from home. Move it on. Billings steers it towards goals. Hits the post. And it's a minor. 13 points the difference. Stratton unsure of the next move. Terrific mark there. Goes with the kick. Gresham leaps over the top. Moves it by foot. A chance to reload the attack now. Stratton sends one up towards the wing. Easily takes the mark. Uses it across half back. The kick from Sicily. Mitchell drops the mark. Putting his skills on display. Loney shrugs off the tackle. Smith gets in the way. This is Carlisle. Hits the target by hand. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Works it across the ground. Frawley takes it strongly. Elects to kick. Great mark under pressure. 40 metres out. An ideal position to be kicking from. He goes for broke. It's offline. Hawthorne bring it back to under three goals. St Kilda have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front.
A strong mark in the pack for MP. St Kilda haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forwards. For Hawthorne with a lot to think about as they trail by 12. St Kilda have come to play. They've got themselves in the game and need to push on now. Let's check out the stats. Hawthorne have turned it over too often today. They aren't coping with the pressure. They should. Players ready to start the second quarter. Umpire ready to resume play. Big thump from McAvoy. Hanover grabbed it clean. Tries to release the pressure. The tackle over the shoulder. Moves the ball by foot. Steele determined to reach the ball. Wingard has the ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match, huh? Brilliant chase. Looks to move it by foot. It's marked by Bruce. He drives it. Patton hangs on to that one. Might be too far out to score. Uses it now. Takes it well. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. St Kilda forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. He'll just throw it. McAvoy has a chance to put a second goal on the ball. He loved that one. Hawthorne behind by six. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. Back in the middle to resume play. Hammers it. Howard with a clean collect. Fighting hard was Abbott. Finding the ball with ease. Slams it home. Gresham loves that goal. The Saints by two goals. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Segler got a fist to it. Here's Phillips. Showed his opponent the ball and took off. Pushes through with power. Marking in space for Johnston. Goes with the kick. Good body work to win the mark. Uses it by foot. Membry presents and takes the mark. A spearing kick. Doing well with the mark. Hanavery a long way out. Just kicks it long. Doing well to intercept that kick. Wingard puts it on the boot. Uses a short handball. He just throws that ball. Goal scoring opportunity for Geary. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Going for goal number one. Hits the post and it's a behind. St Kilda beginning to apply their supremacy on the scoreboard with a lead of 27 to 14. Decides to kick. Marks that ball uncontested. Warple drives the kick. Good mark there. St Kilda just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Kick by Crawley. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. Gets into a good position to take that. How? Spears the ball. Gunston marks in a bit of space. Fumbles the ball. McKenzie. Hurried kick. Patton uses the bump, missed the target. Billings had the pressure bearing down. Loney going for number one. A chance to soccer at him, kicks the goal. Celebrating hard. St Kilda with the ascendancy over Cawthorn, leading 33 to 14. Clears the contest, hacking it out of there. He wins the ball in the air. This is kickable by his standards. Normally a good shot on goal. Get up. 
Grisham pulls the trigger. Just the wrong side of the post. The Saints by 20 points. Teammates break for him. Finds this one all by himself. Frawley drives it out of defensive 50. Sockers it forward. Uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. Slams it on the boot. Stratton looking to track down the footy. Sicily dismisses his opponent with the stain. Bruce gets the ball. Rushes with the kick. O'Brien runs after this one. Disguises it nicely and rushes it through. Carlisle players move as they look to provide an option. Steady hands there as he holds that one. St Kilda have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Took his eyes off the ball. Membry will be the recipient of the free. Moves it by foot. Gresham runs after the ball. Wingard quickly out of the boot. Sinclair couldn't snaffle it. McAvoy collects it. Collected the ball well. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Fantastic tackle. The loose ball picked up. Easily takes the mark. Gets a hand to the ball. Phillips sees off Shields. Robertson goes to the man on the run. He's put it through. Bruce loved kicking that one. Hawthorne close the gap to 13. About to resume hostilities. Thumps it clear. With the ball is McAvoy. Scully found some space and marked. Ball hits the deck. Piopolo just bangs away at goal. Hawthorne get it back under three goals. Weighing up the options now. Plays onto himself. Carlisle moves it now. Marking in space with Robertson. Uses it now. Great mark. Brown kicks it. Hartley wins it back. Still unable to hold on. The siren sounds, and that's the end of the term. The score, St Kilda, 34, to Hawthorne, 22. It's been a promising first half at the Saints. They'd be confident they can keep it going in the second half. Time to see if there's anything interesting in the stats. St Kilda, ready to begin proceedings in the second half. We resume hostilities. McAvoy thumps it forward. Did well to control the ball. Is in his possession. Gets it away. Abbott moves it by hand. And now they're away. He's really turning it on now. That's two now. Finding his feet in front of goals. He acknowledges the crowd. We're back in motion. McAvoy hurls it away. Gathers it now. Howard getting in on the act. He's the number one ranked player on the ground. He's doing everything right. And the umpire will ball it up. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. With the ball now. Slams it onto the boot. McAvoy just swats it away. McAvoy won the hit out. Manages to get out the handball. Blinking by hand. They can create from this. Intercepts the ball well. Frost uses it by foot. Finds a bit of room to mark. The kick from Scully does well to cut off the kick. Burgoyne cuts it off. Interesting handball. And now we'll have a ball up. Segler with the punch. We'll get a ball up on the wing. Punches are clear. Not sure what the problem is from here, but something is definitely wrong. That doesn't look good. I don't think he'll be coming back. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Billings looking a bit sluggish out there. He's kicked it out on the full. Hardwick kicks it long. 
Marked by Warfel. Looks to move it by foot. Frost couldn't stick the tackle. Blasted inside the 50. Dunstan takes the mark and contested. 25 metres out. Golden opportunity here. Can he put it through? He blasts it through for another. Dunstan couldn't be happier with that goal. St Kilda could kick back-to-back -back goals. The margin is 24. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Centre bounce. Thrashes it. Smith with the ball. MP takes it strongly. St Kilda just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Chose to kick it. Gets into some space to mark this. Savage elects to kick. How? There to mop up. Snaffled up by McKenzie. McKenzie throws the ball away. With a driving kick. Takes that one strongly. He drives it towards goal. A great goal. Frost enjoying that goal. He did really well there and gets the reward. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Hawthorne giving themselves a chance on the turnover, but they can't seem to be putting it on the scoreboard. Quick handball. Gets a quick kick away. He'll use the body to take that mark. Plays on. Going for goal number one. Frawley got hands to it, wins the race to the ball. Wants to keep it moving, has it now. Open opportunity for Warfel. Puts boot to ball. Smith does well to mark. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. St Kilda forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. He gives it a ride. Touch through. Hawthorne, reduce the margin. Searching for a teammate. Carlisle plays it to himself. Looks up with the kick. Mitchell over the top. He doesn't want to let his teammates down with this shot at goal. This will certainly test him from this distance. Going for goal number one. He makes that kick count. Full price. Mitchell love kicking that one. Hawthorne now only trailed by 11. We're back in the middle now. McAvoy just swats it away. Geary can't hold on to the tackle. The handball hits the target. Winning the ball in the air was Savage. Puts it on the boot. The contest, no match for him. Of course, Hunter. Moves the ball by foot. Abbott looks in need of a spell. Hands that ball to the opposition. Links with hands. He's got the football now. Power marks uncontested. 30 metres out. Okay. A chance to put a second goal on the ball. Smiles all round. St Kilda, Fleet, Hawthorne, 52 to 35. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Great bit of play that resulted in that goal.
Hawthorne, Kevin been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Spills the mark, looking to kick goal number two. Frawley gets on the end of this. Elects to kick, and the mark will be paid. The handball now from Hardwick, blinking by hand, pushes off the tackler. At the end of three quarters, it's St Kilda, 52, the Hawks, 35. St Kilda fans will be hoping they can hold on and get a memorable victory today. Time to take a look at the stats. Hawthorne needs to make the most of their chances inside 50. They aren't getting too many of them at the moment, so they need to capitalise. Umpire ready to begin the final turn. About to resume play. Clears the contest. Win game with a shorthand pass. They can link up now. Darts it through for another. Get some rewards for his efforts. It's under two goals now. Umpire ready to resume play. Punched away. And now Steele clears the congestion. A good mark under the circumstances. Scully has resources out wide. Just gets a hand in. Collected by Hardwick. We'll get a ball up. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Mitchell drives it out of the pack. Takes a simple grab. Robertson goes with the kick. Impey just put it on the boot. Bruce got under it. Bruce has resources out wide. Buopolo had it, lost it. He flicks it over. Quickly under the boot. Off hands from Stratton. Couldn't snaffle it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He's barely touched the ball lately. Thump clear. Takes possession. Turned it over. Thank now we've got a ball up. Swats it. Brown comes away with the ball. He wins possession. He just can't get out of the action. Great tackle. Constant pressure and rewarded. Goes by foot. Nice mark under pressure. Couldn't keep his hands on it. O'Brien kicks an incredible goal off the ground. Congratulated by his teammates. That's two in a row for Bawthorne. Scoreboard isn't too much of a worry, given how long we have left. Finds a target. He drives it. Gets around Mr. Invisible. Nice. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. Bruce decides to go it alone. Collecting high fives now after that goal. Yes, hello. He's got a couple now. Starting to get into this game. Look at them celebrate that effort. We're back in the middle. Segler with the punch. Clears the ball from the contest. Dunstan gets in a good position. What a talent. What a mark. Gresham doesn't want to let his teammates down with this kick. Intercepts the ball very well. Frawley kicks hard along the boundary line. Takes an uncontested mark. Moved on by Shields. Well collected. Takes the chance and says thank you very much with that goal. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. St Kilda get on top again. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Hands that ball to the opposition. A chance for Phillips. Butler puts it on the boot. The ball mopped up. He's got the footy in his hands. Mops up the loose ball. Goes short by hand. He heads for home. He's put that one through. Billings enjoying that goal. 
St Kilda with the edge right now over the Hawks. Back with another set of bounce. Hammers it. Scoops up the ball. Savage unable to lay the tackle. Didn't get low enough with the tackle. Sinks the slipper into it. The mark is taken by Hartley. Releases the handball. Warful is streaming past and gets the footy. Patton gets a quick kick away. St Kilda are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Butler looks to build some momentum with this kick. They can take the sting right out of the game here. Hill going for number one. Hanabry goes for home. He's enjoying that goal. St Kilda have three in a row. The lead is now 17. He gets his hands on the footy. Seen plenty of it. He couldn't hang on. Fiopolo throws the ball away. Webster with a low spearing kick. St Kilda have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Picked up under pressure. The tackle slipped high and results in a free. Carla uses the body well. Got boot to ball. Brown determined to reach the ball. Goes by hand. He's got the football now. Has it now. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Phillips going for number one. The drop pass sails between the big sticks. He's excited about that one. That's four in a row for St Kilda. The margin is 23. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Cawthon forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Marks now and can send it back. Just got the hands in the back there. Dunstan drives the kick. Patton couldn't hang on to the ball. Ball picked up. It's a turnover. He's getting a lot of the ball, Gas. He's really having a big impact on this game. Outstanding pressure. Well picked up. The umpire will ball it up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaze? This game needs a spark at the moment. Segler receives the ball. We'll get a ball up on the wing. Thump clear. We'll get a ball up on the wing. Punches are clear. Not a great performance, and in the end, it was a poor result for Hawthorne. They weren't far off the mark, but they just couldn't keep their momentum together for long enough. Final scores are 76 to 53. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon. It was great being here, Hutto. I can't wait for the next match.